Folks, thanks for joining me once again. Today is one of my short and sweet e-liquid reviews, and this is the final episode of the Vaporball Ice Cream Social Range. So a big thank you to those guys. Really appreciate you sending me this over for review. The whole ice cream social range, generally they've been pretty banging. In fact, Twister has been my favourite, and I've bought a concentrate and made myself a big bottle of it, which I'm really enjoying. So thank you very much to Vaporball. Go check them out, guys. So let's get crack straight on with these last two, shall we? Sad times. As it's a hot summer's day, I've got a fan running as well. So if you can hear that in the background, I apologise, but it's too bloody hot. So let's start with lemon sorbet, shall we? Do I have to explain what that should be? Let's find out. Drop dead RDA, Aegis Legend, core command point one two, vapor at 90 watts. Let's give it a little bash, shall we? Oh, <coughs> certainly very cooling. Okay, so there's a lot of that cooling sensation in this. A very icy vape and a lemony kick. A cool lemon. It really is a cool lemon. Um, the, the sweetness is about right for this kind of vape, but it's quite hard hitting with a cool lardo. For me, a little bit too much cool lardo. It was very fresh tasting vape. Yeah, like a lemon sorbet. It's like a lemon sorbet, and then you know when you get them warm towels with the lemony scent on them? It's got that kind of, that sounds weird, but that's kind of what I'm getting. Like a, Eating a lemon sorbet and wiping your face with a warm lemony towel. That's what it, that's what it's like. But yeah, the sweetness is about right. It's just very cooling, but it works and it's yeah. That's what you'd expect a lemon sorbet to taste like, really. So that's spot on. So bear with me a minute. I'm just gonna kind of try and sort my flavours out, get rid of some of that cool lada, and then I'll give the last one a try. Okay, now my mouth just tastes like black coffee. Never mind. Okay, next one is Rocket Lolly. If you don't know what a Rocket Lolly is, that's what I loved about this range is it's all the kind of, it just reminds me of my childhood days. Rocket Lolly is like, looks like a rocket. I think it had like strawberry, it was, an, it was pineapple, orange, and strawberry. And I used to love them. I think if you didn't like a Rocket Lolly, what's wrong with you? So anyway, got on the recurved jewel, sitting on top of the Digi Flavor Edge, 0.14, 90 watts. Let's give it a little bash, shall we? Oh, <laughs> that's right up my street. Oh, right. I know some people aren't keen on pineapple because it can come across the wrong way. If it's done right, pineapple becomes a perfect complement for a fruity vape. And I'll try and explain why. So you are getting a hit of pine. Oh, I'm going to go again. Bear with me. The first thing you do get is the pineapple covering your tongue on the inhale. Um, because it's nicely mixed with an orange, it does dumb it down a bit, which is exactly what pineapple needs to work, in my opinion. That's that's what that's what comes across real nice. Nice sweet orangey flavour, sweet pineapple sweetness is absolutely spot on for this one. It's just as I like it. Um, and on the exhale, you get that strawberry, and it's like a, it is like a ripe kind of strawberry, but it's it's like a, oh, yeah, it's like a fresh fruit ripe strawberry. Yeah, that's the best way I can explain it. Bear with me, I'll try again. Maybe a little bit candy like for the strawberry. Maybe actually the whole thing is a bit kind of like a candy kind of flavour, but it works really well. It doesn't completely represent a rocket lolly because there's no cooling sensation in this, or maybe it's just cool I've had that lemon sorbet first. It's not very cooling, it's just all three flavours do work really well. Orange and pineapple on the way in, that does come out on, on the exhale, but you do get that strawberry kind of underneath it. Yeah, it's lovely, beautifully, beautifully blended together. 
In fact, I'd go as far as to say that is a close competitor to Twisted as my favourite out of the range. Yeah, they're on par in my opinion. They're on par. Well, if you do want to know more about Vapor, go check out their websites, folks. Their websites, they've just, they're just got the one website, I think. Check out the website. Have a look at the Ice Cream Social range if it's something you're interested in. Of course, we've reviewed the whole range now, so thank you very much to Vapor Ball. And if you are interested in their range, watch some of my reviews or check out their website online. You can buy it in short fill bottles and you can also buy concentrates, which is what I've done. I've bought a concentrate, mixed it with my VG and my Nick shots. Absolutely spot on. Well, I hope that's helpful, folks. If it was, hit that like button or subscribe if you fancy it. And of course, you can see my latest video here. And this one won't be random. It will be episode two of the Ice Cream Social Range, where I tell you a bit more about Vaporball, what you can expect from them, what you can find on their site, and all that kind of jazz. I'm Flatcat Vapor. Thanks for watching.